Well, this is a story getting plenty of attention on CBS17.com. Last night, we first showed you the video of a man knocking on the door of a home. Yeah, he's standing on the front porch in the dead of the night. Now, since he isn't arrested, we have blurred his face. Now, since this story aired, several neighbors tell CBS17 the same guy has come to their home, too. We sent CBS17's Mackenzie Stasco out to that Durham neighborhood. She joins us live with yet another woman's story about her own close encounter with this mystery man. Well, Angela, that's right. To put it simply, the people in this community are creeped out. They say that there's been a man going door to door, ringing doorbells, knocking on doors in the middle of the night. And they tell me it's happened to multiple people over the past few months. Hello? Hola. It was, I guess, the morning of January 11th, night of January 10th. Hey, what, what can I do for you? This is doorbell video capturing the man at Milan Cherumi's Apex Street home. He had saw me open the door, letting my cat out, so he knew somebody was home. My friend. The man showed up around 2 in the morning. You can hear him mumbling. For me in the house. Asking Cherumi for money. Gave me a kind of a sob story about his car running out of gas and needing $5. Um, told him I didn't have any money, and then he walked off. Cherumi tells me he didn't think much of the encounter until he got an alert from the neighborhood watch group next door. The guy doesn't necessarily give me bad, sketchy vibes, but then I hear a story of the person who had posted on Reddit saying that he was banging on their door for like 18 minutes straight. That same man captured on camera again, doing the same thing at other homes just a few blocks away. Two in the morning, like what could your motivations possibly be? Unless you maybe you're trying to get a somebody in a vulnerable state. Tarumi is hoping police will find the guy and figure out why he's lurking around his neighborhood at night. They probably can't necessarily arrest him for knocking on people's doors. It's not exactly illegal to knock on people's doors, but really just find out what what his motivations or what the deal is. If, if he's got mental issues, get him the help he needs or, or maybe press upon him like how uncomfortable he makes certain people feel, um, especially people who live alone and don't have any kind of like, you know, special protection. Now, in the meantime, one resident tells me she's requested extra patrols from Durham police. She tells me she did see them patrolling her neighborhood last night. Live in Durham, Mackenzie Stasco, CBS 17 News.